Hi, this is Rob Bushway with GottaBeMobile.com, and we are taking a look at Sticky Notes in this Software Inc. show. Sticky Notes comes built in with uh, Windows XP <coughs> and with Vista. Uh, you can normally get to it through the Start programs, and it's normally in the Tablet PC menu. Uh, there it is right there, and there's Sticky Notes. Um, in, in Vista, it's actually Start programs and then sticky notes actually shows up in the in the top level grouping in here okay so sticky notes why would you want to use sticky notes over journal well it's it is designed to be a very lightweight um, small app designed just to take that little jotting down that you want to take so uh, somebody calls you on the phone you're you know, you're driving down the road, you got your tablet PC on or your UMPC on, and they say, hey, uh, why don't you call me later after you get settled, and you need somewhere just to jot it down real quick. And you write down, call John. And then you, um, you know, you're driving down the road some more, and cell phone rings again. Um, you get a note uh, for you to call Susie when you get back to the office. And let's let's say that you you stop and you um, you know you're going over your notes and things like that and you want to record a voice note to actually remind yourself to do something. Then you can click this uh, record button and you can record using the just the you know the built-in mic on your tablet or your UMPC and uh, record a voice note. So you get back to your office and you have the stack of sticky notes and you can tell you've got three notes that you need to go back and take a look at. Okay, I need to call John. Um, you know what, I'm going to do that later, but I need to file this. So I'm going to copy this and put it into my regular note-taking application, whether it's journal or whether it's OneNote or what have you, and you just paste it in there for you to do something with it later. And then you delete it. Okay, I've got two more here. I've got uh, one of two. Call Susie. Okay, I'll, I'll go ahead and call her and then I'll delete it. And let me go ahead and listen to this voice note and hit play and listen to it and act on it. So it's designed if you can picture all these little post-its floating around and it, um, this is designed that has a stack of post-it notes. Um, several things that you can do with your sticky notes. If you go to tools and options you can open it up at startup so that it's always there, um, very lightweight, not taking up very very much uh, memory. Uh, you can have it always run on top and enable the scratch out gesture. Now, in the past, I've actually had problems getting the scratch out gesture to work. I've mostly been trying this on Vista, so I'm going to give it a try here. And you know what? I still cannot get the scratch out gesture to work. That's really odd. It doesn't work on XP and it doesn't work. It doesn't work in XP and it doesn't work on Vista. Very odd. Um, some of the options, um, again, open at startup, confirm on delete, and always on top. You can also export these notes out. So if you get another computer or you need to send your sticky notes to somebody else, then you can export them and it creates it as an SNT file. Then you can send those sticky notes to somebody else. And then if you need to import somebody's sticky notes, you can go to Tools and choose Import. Now for the most part, the uh, Vista sticky notes works exactly the same. Um, there are very, very few, very few differences. There may be a couple more buttons up here. Um, but it, you know, for the most part, it works exactly the same. I think the one thing that um, I think maybe this drag and drop and the copy and things like that are over here to the left um, and then the X is over here to the right. Other than that, that's a very, um, it's, there's not much to sticky notes. There's not supposed to be much there. It's just supposed to allow you to take that quick note and move on. Uh, if you're new to your tablet PC and you're watching this ink show, tr just trying to get an idea as to what it does, I'd encourage you to take a look at it. Maybe uh, keep it on your startup for a little while. Um, maybe it'll help you transition into OneNote because uh, OneNote has a nice little 
application. Uh, it's called a quick note, um, or I mean a side note that lets you take side notes and then those get um, stored within the larger application. S same kind of concept as uh, sticky notes, but probably runs in a lot less memory footprint. I would imagine you could do more with that note by using the OneNote side note, but um, at least using sticky notes, it doesn't cost you any extra money. So again, this has been Rob Bushway with a quick look at sticky notes. Uh, appreciate your patronage, and we'd like to thank our sponsor, TechSmith.com, makers of Camtasia Studio, uh, which we are using to record this ink show, and Snagit. Snagit is a great little tool to take um, take little snapshots and uh, snagits of screenshots. Again, thank you so much.